Good morning, happy Friday. Let's get the day started. Unboxed a lot of PR last night. Follow me on Instagram at Danielle Carolyn. That's where I did this whole unboxing. I need to take out all these boxes. <laughs> Big coffee morning, oh my goodness. What a magical sight. <laughs> We're starting off with our daily planner. Big day today. We've got lots of furniture deliveries. My dining table is finally getting delivered, so no more working on a card table. And my entryway storage is coming as well. So just prepping for the day. So I've had this card table that I bought on Amazon as my table. My table's getting delivered, which is so exciting. And I'm doubling my dining table as a desk. So we'll see how long this lasts, but you know. We'll see, but I'm excited. So I need to clear the way for them. Um, I'm excited, more furniture. Next time I vlog, there'll be a dining table right there. How exciting. And then I can finally take these chairs, put them over there. I am so excited. Ta-da. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. It like totally brightens up my kitchen too, I feel like. So now I'm gonna bring those chairs over here. Let's see how it looks. Wow, you guys, I am obsessed. This is so beautiful. This feels so good. Wow, I'm I'm so happy, and now it's so blank over there. I'm just waiting on that couch, baby. Get me to the couch. Um, it's so weird, I'm so used to this card table here. I'm gonna have to get used to having a different table, but I really like it. I wanna start decorating it. How cute. Have a candlelit dinner. Like, tell me that's not adorable. Oh my gosh, and I know I need to put all that away. I just have to do the haul. New workstation, I love it, oh my gosh. Editing right now, I ordered some juice press. I needed some greens in my body. Got two Dr. Green juices in one, love at first sight. <laughs> Gonna drink this one, it's green apple, kale, spinach, and lemon. Me showers and puts my PJs back on. Nice. <laughs> I didn't really like fully introduce this vlog, but hey, what's up? We're doing a little weekend in my life vlog, getting my life together. I was in Aspen this past week. <laughs> my flight got canceled, drove four hours to Denver, flew out of Denver to Vegas, from Vegas to here. And then when we landed yesterday mornings, so we took a red eye, our bags didn't make it. Still don't have my bags, hence why I look like crap. I don't have my hairbrush. I don't have any of my hair tools. I don't have my makeup. It's of my favorite clothing items, um, so. But I'm really thankful that United is returning them to me today, hopefully, or my suitcase, which is really exciting. But yeah, so basically I slept all day yesterday. I got nothing done. I literally had to cancel all my meetings yesterday and today just to get my life together. I feel so crappy because I didn't post a video on time and that's so not like me. Um, so I'm uploading a video right now. And yeah, I just need to get my life together. Having this dining table is really exciting. I have another delivery today. I'm getting my little entryway piece. I wanna clean, I wanna order groceries, like we're just gonna get our life together and then it's also gonna be a fun weekend. So it's gonna be a really fun vlog. Right now I'm uploading this video and then in two minutes I'm hopping onto therapy. I haven't talked to my therapist since I've moved to New York because I've just been in the best mood and life is good and I think even if your life is great and you're happy, sometimes it is still good to check in if you have a therapist, to check in with your therapist. Um, it's really important to me and I feel like I've just been really overwhelmed lately. And there are some things on my mind that I just wanna like talk to someone with an unbiased opinion. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm so excited to talk to her. And I think I'm just gonna have a clear headspace after. And I just haven't really been able to relax and I feel like she's gonna tell me how to relax, which is sad to say. Love it. Anyways, welcome to another weekend in my life. It's gonna be a really fun weekend. We have a pregame tonight. Going to, a con going to the Mountain Joy concert on Sunday. Tomorrow we're doing shopping, UGA game. Fun weekend ahead, and I'm so excited to vlog for you guys. So subscribe if you guys are new here, and I'll, I'll talk to you guys after therapy. <laughs> I'll be better. Literally was finishing therapy, and the guys knocked on my door, but here's my new little piece. This is from West Elm. I love it because it literally just blends in with the wall, but it has so much storage. I'm trying, I just texted Sierra, my interior designer, because I was, I, they initially had it faced like this was this way, I don't know, that could be nice too. I open it, I wasn't sure which way she meant, so I just have them face it this way. That's what all these baskets are for. I'm gonna put them in here, and it's just gonna be so much extra storage. 
It's from West Elm. I absolutely love it. This will be gone very soon, but I really like it. And it's just, I mean, it's not like the prettiest thing in the world, but I just needed more storage. And that's what we got here. So I'm really excited. This is what it looks like facing this way. Might be a little easier because then I just, because oh, <laughs> I open it like this. But then like, does that look weird? I don't know. I'm literally sending Sierra pictures. I'm like, what do I do? <laughs> I forgot to mention, also mid-therapy, the guy called and had my suitcase, you guys. I hope everything made it okay. I am literally so happy. I thought I'd never see this again. <laughs> Say hello to my new couch, the chairs. <laughs> I am laughing at how mess of a person I am today. Like, the way I look. I haven't even opened my suitcase yet. It's where I have my hairbrush in there. I have clothes on my bed. I just did a little PR haul for my Instagram. We're gonna go get a wax, cause that's what we do. European wax center is the best, so I'm gonna go do that. Then I'm gonna come back, and then I have pretty much the rest of the afternoon to clean and everything, and then I'm going to dinner tonight. It'll be great. I always dread getting a wax, and then I always leave in the best mood, cause I talk to them the whole time, and Sky is amazing. She's my girl, I'm gonna go to her next time. And now I'm just feeling nice and clean and waxed and fresh. So like, it's always the best and it's so nice out. It's my first time really being outside for the day. So I'm just walking back now. Okay guys, I'm really proud of myself. I just sat down and focused and got my weekend of my life vlog done so that I know it's gonna go up this Sunday. Finally, I have my hairbrush and my toiletries. It's the little things in life. We're gonna take a second shower because I literally look so disgusting. I just wasn't in the mood to wash my hair earlier, but now it's time to wash the hair, get ready for the weekend. Freshly showered, let's clean my room. We're gonna change my sheets. I just wanna get my life together before I go out for the night. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna put these clothes away. I got some new clothes from Revolve, and yeah, I'm gonna put these away. <laughs> So you guys already know how much I love Brooklyn and I swear my sleep has changed since I started using Brooklyn in. The sheets are just so soft, so comfortable. It's time to change my sheets. And this video is actually sponsored by Brooklyn in, which is so exciting because I literally use their products. So now I have an extra set of sheets, which is always so exciting. So like while I'm washing one, I can put on the other pair. So this is so exciting. One thing I love about Brooklyn in too is anytime you place an order, you get a tote bag in the mail. Or like when I went to the store in Brooklyn to buy these sheets, I got even a bigger tote. So that was really exciting and you feel really cool because I feel like everyone in New York has their little Brooklyn and tote bag So I feel like I'm part of the group Don't mind me in my robe and everything high quality bed sheets are typically very expensive But that's what I love about Brooklyn and you get these like really soft really luxurious sheets for an affordable price Which we love before I show you guys the sheets I have to let you guys know that Brooklyn and is offering my Dan fam a special offer So if you spend a hundred dollars you can get $20 off. So, I mean, that's incredible. So if you click the link down below and use the code Danielle, that'll get you that awesome discount. So definitely, definitely utilize it. I'll honestly probably use it myself. So I got the Brooklyn and Lux Hardcore Sheet Bundle. It's what I have on my bed right now too, but now I have an extra. Um, so excited for the sponsorship. I can't get over it. <laughs> so it comes with extra pillowcases, the core sheet set, and this is the Lux one, which typically costs 200 to $250, depending on the size of your bed. But usually sheets of this quality would be like $500. So that's why I'm obsessed. I get the Lux one because it's, it's the most popular one. It feels like you're in a hotel bed, but it's literally your own home. I, I can't get over it enough. Like all of my friends have Brooklyn in. So I have the core sheet set. And then it also comes with a duvet cover. So you've got the whole setup. It's super sleek, it's super white, but they also have other colors too. I just like that all white look. So I wanna open this up for you guys and show you how incredible, like you can even tell through the camera how soft this is gonna be. So this is sateen material, which is so amazing. It's They recommend it for year round, because sometimes people have like winter sheets and summer sheets, which is also awesome. They have great linens and everything like that. But I like this one because it's great for all of the seasons. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's like butter. That's the best way to describe it is literally getting into butter. I get so excited to go to bed every night strictly because of these sheets. And I mean, my mattress is great too, but like, come on. 
And you can also save 25% by purchasing them all in the bundle rather than buying each one individually. That's what I learned when I was buying it myself. The online experience is super easy too. You can select what you want and they describe all the sheets. So they'll be like, this is better for winter. This is better for summer or all the different things, like the different material you wanna feel. If you're not able to go to the store, it's so easy online. I have towels from Brooklyn and I have a bath mat. Like I've got it all. So yeah, I am going to strip my current sheets, pop those in the wash so they're good to go for next time and then I'm gonna put my new sheets on. I'm literally so excited. I'm just gonna sleep so good tonight. So something I love about these pillowcases that my mom actually pointed out to me when she was here helping me move in. This is like a really nice feature of pillowcases when they have this flap that goes on the inside so you don't see the pillow, you know? It's like what they have at hotels. Love it. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Ta-da! Wow, this just looks like an absolute dream. Again, check out the link down below and use the code Danielle to get $20 off a $100 order. You'll probably end up sending more because there's just so many amazing things that you're gonna want. Washing the other sheets so I can have them on deck when I wanna change my sheets again. <gasps> Hi, baby! Hi, Finn! Oh my God, I miss him so much. Good boy. So I just finished getting ready. I did my makeup. I attempted to do my hair. It's not perfect, but that's okay. I'm headed to dinner with Margo. I'm so excited. Um, we're going to this American Express pop-up diner in Brooklyn. And I'm really excited and she asked me to go with her. And I'm really pumped because we've never hung out just the two of us, we've always hung out in groups. So I'm pumped to chat with her and eat dinner. I'm so hungry, I didn't really have dinner, or lunch, I mean. So really pumped about that. I really like my outfit, it's a little chilly out so I couldn't wear the outfit I had planned. So here is tonight's fit. Blazers are just the moment these days. This is a short sleeve top from Revolve. Like my sticky boobs are showing, it's just gonna have to happen. Blazer, I think it's from Nasty Gal like a couple of years ago, but I really like it. I like the fit of it. Jeans are my citizens of humanity jeans. I'll link them down below. I love how they fit. They're the, called the trouser jeans. Air Force Ones. Bag is Balenciaga off of Forward, um, which is like Revolve's luxury website. I'm wearing these new earrings from Cupcakes and Cashmere. I love them. They're so cute, especially if you have double piercings. So ideally, I'll like put these on the second um, hole like in the next few days and then wear like a bigger hoop too. I, I love that look of the layers. So yeah, this is the fit. Let's go eat. So I'm here at the diner with Margo. I'm here at the diner in the parking lot. It's actually so fucking cute. <laughs> it's so cute, you guys. Like I'm obsessed. Apparently this is the first night of it. It's like a swanky diner. Anyways, they gave us crayons and crossword or uh, word searches. We both found one word, but that's it. It's really hard. It's really challenging. It's an adult word search for sure, but this is so cute. Oh, it's a Man, I have not. She found another word. Anyways, fun. Good morning. Good morning. Go dogs. Oh my gosh, thank you. Happy Saturday. Ryan just brought me a bagel and left. <laughs> I've got breakfast in a show. <laughs> We're recapping the night as if we weren't together. I know. Hey, girly, what's up? Happy Halloween. This is my costume. It's so scary. <laughs> Guys, this is the ideal Saturday morning. Brian just dropped off a bagel. Sweet angel. He's headed to the George Bar to watch the game, and it's a noon game, so I'm just going to watch it here because I just don't want to do that right now. But I'm happy he's gonna have a little bros day. I think I'm gonna have a little morning here. Maybe I'll unbox my plant today. <laughs> wow, that's so lame sounding. Maybe I'll unbox my plant. Brooke's doing moving things. And um, Morgan and I might go shopping in Soho later. So that's kind of the lay of the land. I also just took out a green juice that I Uber Eats yesterday. We're just having a morning. We're having a morning. I'm watching the Georgie game in bed. Face Tammy Morgan. <laughs> it's so cute. Um, go dogs. Go dogs. Touchdown! Let's go! Oh my god. Gonna start nine perfect strangers. I'm so excited. I've been wanting to watch this. We're just having ourselves a little lazy day. All right, guys. I don't know what's come over me today. I think just the long week has finally hit me. And I don't know, I think I'm just still dead from the Aspen trip and then just getting a ton of stuff done when I got back. 
And my body is just like, no, stop it. I had plans to go shopping in Soho today with Morgan. And I got up to take a shower to go and I took the shower and then I was just, I texted Morgan and I was like, I just, I am so dead. Like I don't have anything, I, I don't know what's wrong with me. And she was, she called me immediately and was like, Let's just scratch today. You need rest, whatever. Which is like such a power friend move. She totally could have been like, just rally or like, you know, let's wait a couple hours. But I kind of needed that mental capacity of like, I'm not going anywhere today. That's what I'm doing. And it's hard because like, do you guys ever have, I ordered Chipotle. Do you guys ever have this problem where it's like, you decide to stay in, but then you're on your phone the whole time looking at Instagram stories and where everyone is and everyone's texting you. Like I have people FaceTiming me and I'm like, I feel like, like it's like I'm not even able to relax because I feel like I should be out. So um, I'm really trying to relax right now. And I'm eating some early dinner. It's five o'clock, got some Chipotle. Um, I just started nine from Fake Strangers. And I'm hoping this food will give me a little bit more energy and then I'll do some cleaning. I still haven't opened up my second potted plant. Like Ryan's at Oktoberfest right now and here's 17. He was calling me like, do you want to come? And I just like, I don't have the capacity. I'm hoping that I have some more energy to do something later. I don't know. Like, I feel like I did so much this week, but the weekend is when all my friends want to do something because they all, you know, like work nine to fives all week. So I'm just trying to find that balance. Not complaining, I'm just letting you guys know where I'm at right now. I just like, my chest feels tight. I just feel like, I don't know. I don't know what's like best for me right now other than eating this Chipotle and watching Hulu. So, cheers. When I start to feel overwhelmed like this and just anxious and just weird, I go outside in some capacity and I listen to music and just breathe deep, <laughs> all the things. So I'm literally just in my PJs. Put on a sweatshirt. I'm gonna go to my roof. I put my AirPods in. We're just gonna go up there and just get some fresh air. That's the one thing about like not having a balcony and stuff like I did in Georgia. Um, but I have a roof, so let's go. That gave me the taste of nature and being outside that I needed. I'm feeling a little better. I was listening to this playlist I have on Spotify. It's public, it's called Magic. And it's very just like magical songs like Wonder by Shawn Mendes. You guys always hear me say when my room's a mess, I'm a mess, my apartment's a mess, I'm a mess, my apartment's pretty clean. But I have to do the dishes. I really wanna unbox this plant. We'll see if I ever do that. I could make my bed and I think that might make me feel a little better. I also thought about going for a walk, but I think I wanna do this first and then if I'm still feeling like whatever, I'll go for a walk. So let's get started, let's set the vibes. Today's not over, I can still make today an amazing day. Let's do it. Something about lighting those candles made me really want to listen to this song by Nora Jones. Um, anybody else? I don't know why. Guys, the vibes right now are locked. Jazz music is on. I have like every candle ever going. I took out the trash. Those are baskets I need to return. They don't fit in there. Oh, content. Okay, I put this little draft stopper in, so we'll see if it works. Cause basically every time someone opens the door in my hall, my door like moves. So let's see if this works. Also, how does it look from the outside? Not very cute. All right, so it's a little later. I FaceTimed with my dad. He's actually coming to visit me on Monday, so that's really exciting. I'm making myself a little latte. I haven't had coffee today yet. I'm feeling good about the position my apartment's in. 
Got my hair up in a roller. Oh, it's not working very well. I didn't do it tight enough. But um, Ryan and some of his friends, some of my friends wanted to go to my roof tonight. And I was like, oh, that's perfect. Like some people will go out. Maybe I'll go out if I'm feeling it. I don't even know if I want to drink though. And like, I'm fine with that. I'm like so down to be at a pregame sober. Like I don't care, but I'm just going to have a coffee and like, oh, there it goes. Guys, look at this. Getting all the ingredients. Just going to have a little oat milk iced latte. I just can't do the drink all weekend thing. Like I really, I just can't. I act like I can, but I can't. Especially if like I take shots of fireball on a Friday night. I, I'm, it's not sustainable for the rest of the weekend for me. I, in the future, I think I need to pick my days and maybe like not go hard Friday night and then Saturday like have a nice, I don't know, I don't know guys. Anyways, this is lame. So I'm gonna get ready now. Getting in a good mood. I like my outfit, I think that's why. <laughs> okay, you guys, I had a full 180. I listened to this dance party hits playlist on Spotify. Got me hyped. The latte did me well. Um, and I just like my outfit. So I'm just in a really good mood. Brooke's having a little pregame, so I'm gonna pop over and say hi. And then I'll wait till people come here and then I'm gonna go upstairs. I don't really know. I'm just bopping around. I don't, I don't know how to go out in New York at all. <laughs> I just wanna see people. Um, so here's my little fit for tonight. I'm like obsessed with it. Um, this dress, I'll link it below, it's from Revolt. I've been looking for just more like casual dresses I can wear with boots. This is perfect. Bag, you guys already know. Boots are from Lou Casey. You guys all correct me. Lou Casey, I think. Lou Chessy? No, it's Lou Casey. So yeah, that's the fit. I'm gonna go say hi to them. Oh, and I switched that cool chain earring to my second piercing and put a hoop and I like how they um, look together. So yeah. Okay, hey guys, so I went to Brooke's apartment for a little bit, hung out with them, and then I was like, wait, I haven't heard from Ryan. Like, we're supposed to be doing this pregame. Come to find out, he took a nap, and his alarm was going off, but he just didn't hear it. So me and Katie come over here, figure out a way to like get up into, I knew his apartment would be unlocked. So we like unlocked it, woke him up, he was so confused. Um, but unfortunately that means the pregame, there was like people here or at my place and they didn't know how to, they didn't know my name. They were like Ryan's friends. So they just like left, I guess, cause he was answering his phone. Bye, bye. It's all good. So <laughs> I think like, I was like, I'm all dressed up. Like, let's do something. And um, Ryan was like, you can go out if you want. But like all my friends were at different places. Brooke wasn't going to go out. So I think we're gonna go to the comedy club again. <laughs> we should like get a membership at this point. It's Ryan, he's eating. <laughs> um, I think it's just like so good for the soul and it's so funny. So I think we're gonna go to New York Comedy Club. We'll see. But yeah, that's what's up. Court. All right, he's drinking White Claw, I'm taking a ginger shot. Did you drink White Claw? Oh, oh, sorry, beer. beer. All right, cheers. Woo! Woo! We're home. <laughs> Morgan joined us. <laughs> Here we are. Today. Good morning, you guys. Happy Sunday. These hash browns from Trader Joe's are like the best. They taste like the ones from McDonald's. I mean, tell me that doesn't look incredible. Little grocery store outfit of the day because I don't really have groceries. That's why I made the hash browns. I don't even have coffee pods. Wearing my new New Yorker Nowhere hat. I love it. It's with collaboration with um, Magnolia Bakery. It's really cool. Year of ours romper. I love it. I wear it all the time. I'll link it below. Shirt is from Revolve. I throw it over like everything. Same bag. Ryan's here. He's coming grocery shopping too. And my Amazon slides. So I don't know if it matches. It's a lot of blue. But you know, let's go get some groceries. Grocery haul time. Just got the basics because my dad's coming tomorrow to visit. And we're going out to eat a lot, I know. Um, but I got some eggs. I got blueberries. I got more Keurig cups. I used the Starbucks ones. Texas Pete hot sauce, because for breakfast this morning, I'm gonna make, I used to make them a lot at school. Um, like Ryan, he didn't invent them, but that's who showed me them. Making scrambled eggs and putting in a tortilla with hot sauce, the best. That being said, I got some tortillas. I got some blackberries, baby carrots, of course. Dave's killer bread, green beans, black beans, chicken noodle soup for a rainy day, and bananas. That's 
the grocery haul. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I missed this. Gonna drink this Dr. Green juice and get some work done. In Brooke's new apartment, you guys. It's so beautiful. We're about to record an episode of Gals on the Go. We're doing an episode all about how to travel like a gal on the go. Her view is absolutely unreal. I just can't believe it. I like it better at night, but it is still so <laughs> I mean, yeah. Something about the lights, though. Like, seeing the lights at night. The lights, it's, it's so, magical. so magical. So... Yeah, check out her vlogs for all the tours and stuff, but oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. So happy for you. Yay. All right, guys, quick change. We're going to the Mount Joy concert. I'm so excited. It's the perfect Sunday activity. It's a beautiful day. It's going to be a golden hour. I am so excited. I'm meeting up with Mary Stephen Morgan and then one of Mary Stephen's friends from college. So that'll be really fun. We're going to go grab like an early dinner slash like appetizers at Cobble & Co., which is at the seaport. I love that area so much because the concert is at Pier 17, which is right there. So it's gonna be really, really fun. Wearing my new wide brim hat from Olive from Peak. I don't care if you guys think it's too big. I think it's fun and I was having a bad hair day and I didn't have as much time to get ready as I thought I would after recording. Mini dress you guys have seen before. It's from Revolve. I wear it all the time. I'll link it down below. Bag is from H&M. It's just really nice and convenient. It keeps it right close to me. And then my All Saints sneakers. Um, and then I'm bringing sunglasses, of course. So yeah, I'm really excited. I love Mount Joy's music. I just think it's gonna be really relaxing. Oh, what should be good. I'm wearing these sunnies. Let's go. is over there so it's perfect lots of people watching Head into the concert. it's my first concert in New York I'm excited this is a really cool of this weekend vlog. I'm about to put some laundry in and wash my face and everything like that and head to bed because my dad comes tomorrow. He's staying with me. He's, uh, I have an air mattress and he's gonna sleep out here. So I'm really excited for him to see the place and I'm excited. I'm obviously gonna be vlogging it. The concert was so much fun. I met a lot of you guys, so thanks for saying hey. And it was just such a good vibe. So I'm really, really happy I went. But yeah, if you guys are new here, make sure to subscribe so you get notified every time I post a video, which is every Wednesday and Sunday. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.